How's it going ladies and Bruce is up, I'll be six killed. welcome back to Bloodstained Ritual of the Night, we are back. All I've done is run back, we are back at the uh, starting area, it's time to turn in some missions, and grab new missions, and all of that crap. All that good stuff, you know. Have you learned anything? Here's what I've turned up. We got a lot more to kill, but not much more actually done. Uh, this episode's pretty much going to be another exploring episode. It's good to see you. Might have no bosses Enjoy again. Which is a shame. I do like finding bosses, and we're not doing a lot of that, but uh, you never know. We might get lucky next time, who knows. We got a lot of stuff here. What ones are we using at the moment? On here we're using Welcome Company, which is maxed out, I believe. Shadow Tracer, create a shadow double. That's pretty cool. Didn't even know we had that. Circular Ripper, that sounds badass. I like that. We can actually upgrade Reflector Ray. I don't know what that's for, but that's cool. We got a lot of stuff here now. Oh, that's a new, uh... One of these is new. I don't think we had that Kara boss, did we? I don't think we did. Oh, I should check, uh, prepare. Are you what are we transmuting this time? Strawberry cake! I have strawberry cake, I love strawberry Wait. cake. Stop back. Alright, we'll hit up the save point. Yeah, I don't really know where to go. We just gotta see where there, uh, where there's gaps in the map that we might be able to use our invert power, where we might not have been able to get. Head over there and see if we can find something new, something we haven't seen already. So I got a pimple on my lip and it's hurting and, and stuff. And it doesn't even have the decency to hide under my bed. You. What are you looking Rude, to eh? <laughs> Is this right? Thank you. Oh yeah, we got that key. Thank you. We found the carpenter's key. Um I don't know where that goes. I probably have seen the door before, but I don't remember where. Bless you. Maybe I didn't, or maybe I haven't, but I, I mean, I probably have. I've seen a lot of locked doors so far. There's that one in the well, but that wasn't a carpenter's key. Alright, let's see where we're gonna go next. So, secret sorcery lab. Hall of Termination. Hmm, not too sure. Maybe uh, over here, the dragon area. We haven't been back there in quite some time. The Towers of the Twin Dragons. There's that little gap right there that we could might be able to get to with a uh, invert. Reasonable chance. Maybe there's something there that'll help us uh, progress. I don't know. At least the enemies here should be pretty weak to us now. We should be able to smoke these fools. Two hits. You're not bad. Two hits is uh, pretty decent. So yeah, we're probably not going to fight a boss again. We're probably just going to be exploring. But uh, if you're okay with that, let's do it. I mean, finding things is uh, half the fun. The exploration element in the game is half the reason to play it, isn't it? The exploring is pretty amazing. One of the things I love the most about it, actually. Let's just head right down to the bottom. There's quite a few areas that look like we might be able to use it. There was a bit over here too. Oh yeah, there is a few. Let's just head straight up here. That was scary. Here we go. Ow! Aegis Plate. What does that do? Nullifies all damage from traps and hazardous environments. <gasps> Are you serious? We know where there's more of those near the start. Okay, well that's huge. That just changed everything. Alright, alright. Well, we got, um... Damn, now I'm on this, uh, path thing. We got a few more things to explore yet. There's a few areas here that we might be able to explore with Invert. We should head to them too. I want to get off this though, I hate being on this thing. The 3D thing is, you know, really nice and all, but it's a pain in the ass.
Can I just go? Let me go. How do we get down here? There's something down there by the look of it. Where are we? Let's do it. Let's see what happens. Nothing? Nothing here. Is that Aegis play any better for uh, defending? As far as armor goes compared to what I was using? 25. No! No! Flame mail is way better. Okay, so we only want to use this. Specifically for getting through traps, I should switch back to my uh, flame mail. Alright, uh, where are we now? There's nothing going to be over there, I don't think. Let's head back this way. There's a couple more areas that we should be able to invert to get to. I don't know about that gap down there, but we'll figure that out another time. How do we get to that bit? This this square right here that my curse is on. How do you get into there? That I don't know. I assume we get there from the elevator, but we'll, we'll check this bit first. There's that other bit. This is the bit over here that I was going to go to originally. But then I got distracted. And it turned out to be really, really good that I got distracted. Because it got us the Aegis Plate. Confused. Do I have to get up there? Why am I bothering with that? Just invert. I can't go that way. I don't know how to get over there either then. Well, I mean, we get we got what we came for, I guess. I do want to find out what else is here, though. It's been so long since we've been here, too. Unguard, I dare you. Through here? Dude, you guys can survive a hit too. Not as strong as I thought I was, jeez. My, my bubble's gone, I just realised. Oh yeah, the bubble was showing me where uh, everything was, right? No, it wasn't. Where the hell are we now? I'm getting confused. It looks like we covered that little bit of area. Oh. Alright, we should just find a teleporter then. There's one this way, we'll just keep going. Find the teleporter and we'll head back to uh, the starting area. Bless you. Actually, it might be interesting to explore this area with Invert. It looks like I've covered it pretty thoroughly, though. But still. Invert. Kind of makes this uh, crossing everything kind of cheap. Okay, okay. 
Let's go. So we want to head to, I guess, um, I guess it's quickest just to go back there and walk. It's like the first, the first thing, isn't it? Pretty sure. Arise, myself and my shadow. They say I can just like run through everything and they just instantly die around me. Like I'm like the Grim Reaper. <laughs> everything just dies as we walk. Like we are the bringer of death. Hey, our orb's back. That's cool. Alright, alright. Oh, better put the Aegis plate on. Lose a bit of our defense, but it's all good. It's all good. Invert. Going up. Or down. Whatever. <laughs> I don't even know. It doesn't really matter, does it? Going down up. Nice. This must be the new area that we're heading to. Wait, there must be something in here, right? Really? There's nothing here? This whole room is empty? The hell is the point of that? <laughs> Alright, come on then. It's been a while since we used this uh, stained glass hand thing as a actual thing. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. We haven't need to use it for a long time. Alright. New stuff to explore. Love it. Invert. Which way? I guess we go this way. Invert. This is a new area. Maybe this will take us to where the carpenter's key is. Perhaps. The Oriental Sorcery Lab. Brand new area. Alright, let's uh, change our gear back before we get murdered by something. Things here are going to be scary strong, no doubt. Yeah, they're way stronger than what I've become used to now. Weaklings. The music is cool. Arise, myself and my shadow. Back off. Two grand. Oh my god, look. Dipshit's back again. I don't have a waystone for him this time. Pickpocket. Ooh. How do I get down to you? When I find a way down there, I'll be down there. I guess the next boss will help me out. Okay, we got all new enemies and all new powers to gain. Increased strength. Does that just increase our damage output? Because that'd be badass. Dude, they're all dropping their shards straight away. Petra Breath. Release the gas that causes petrification. Okay. I don't know how to get down to that either. Arise, myself and my shadow. Back I say. Foul monkey. Foul monkey demon. Arise, myself and my shadow. Okay, well that's a level up, I'll take it. It's been a while since we fought such scary ass enemies. What is this? Are we for serious right now? It's a teleporter? Oh my god. Oh my god, he's using ninja powers on us! Dude, these guys are so strong! I'm so unused to being overpowered. Which teleporter are we going through? This one?
Let's try this one. God damn it. <laughs> Screw you teleporters, you bastards. Petra breath. No thanks. Ramen. Hmm. But do we need chips or something for that lady? Don't jutsu me, asshole. Jutsu you. Oh my god, my brain. Does it change depending on uh, what side you go through it? It does. Oh my god, I'm so confused. Make it stop, please. Yes! Oh no. There's so many here. Let's just avoid all of them and then we don't have to worry. Oh no! We don't have to worry about them. Son of a bitch! Stop fucking with me, game! Oh my god, we just did the portal thing. Stop! Oh, thank God. Invert. Invert. Whoops. Invert. Okay. Oh. Petrification breath. Dude, that's got some range on it. I actually got clipped by it. He switched. He flipped to the roof. He can do it too. Not cool, bro. You're a bad ninja and I don't like you. Arise, myself and my shadow. Dude, there are so many baddies here. This is getting ridiculous. Are you guys quite finished? Stop throwing ninja stars at me, bloody hell. Freaking dying out here. Did my paintings hit you? Yes, good. Screw you monkey bastards. Terrifying. They always jump right into it, like assholes. Alright. Tell me there's a save point nearby, I can really do with one. HP up? No, I wanted HP up. Let's check this door down here. Oh wait, I probably can't do that without getting murdered. I guess I may have to take some potions. Bastard. That's a boss door. That's a boss door. I'm a scared. I'm a scared we're not going to survive this. That's why I'm afraid we weren't going to survive that. Okay. So we are finally back to where we were. This is going to be a baddie. Almost certainly. Um, yeah. Arise, myself and my shadow. We got destroyed out there, but at least we found our way back. If nothing else. 
We're back now, although that doesn't really help us survive. I feel like we missed a door that probably had a uh, oh, save point in it. So we're gonna try and find that. I think these monkeys are doing the most damage. The monkeys are jerks, man. Like, the ninjas are really strong too, to be fair. But, I still feel like the monkeys are doing the most damage. Because they're jumping around, they're super erratic and shit. Okay, it's a teleporter. That's handy, though. At least we know it's there now. Worst comes to worst, we can just go to the teleporter and get the hell out. GTFO. You know? See, they just jump straight into you, the monkeys. They'll just be like, yeah, I'm gonna just jump into you. Ow. That's why they're so scary. They just jump straight into you, with no regard for their own life. Or anything. They're just psycho. I wish we could hit a bit harder. I feel like they tank our hits like then, like like our hits are nothing. Do we not have health potions? Hmm, I guess not. Scrumptious. Scrumptious. Get our stat boost on, I guess. Goddamn monkeys are everywhere! Get off! Why is the cow able to do that? I don't understand. Invert. This place is a nightmare. I don't want to be here anymore. I don't want to go this way because it'll end up respawning all the dudes. Oh, Ooh, hair apparent. Don't know why I did that. Do you know all the assholes are back? I'm too scared to go down there. Gotcha. Alright. Bad monkey. Jerk ass monkey. Be gone. Maybe it's easier to fight them from the rooftop. Whoa! Feel like it might be easier to fight them while upside down. Go paintings! Hit him in the foot until he dies. Yeah, suck it, dickhead. Suck it. Suck a fat one. Alright, here we go. Level up. Always good. I'm starting to struggle, man. Ow. Asshole. I say starting to struggle. I've been struggling the whole way. I've struggled the all, my whole way through this game. From the very beginning. I'm just gonna stay on the roof. I feel like it's safer up here. Ah, what the hell? Oh yeah, I've got no healing items. Run! Run! Run until we find a save point. That's interesting. Why is that a breakable thing? Manju. Oh, it's his nose! I didn't even see that! It's a guy, I just knocked the tip of his nose off. Sorry, dude. I mean, knock the tip of your nose off. That's rough, man. You know you're having a bad day when someone knocked the tip of your nose off. That's how I judge a bad day, anyway. 
Well, it's not the only thing I judge it on, I guess, because I don't get the tip of my nose knocked off that much, but on the rare occasions that it does happen, you know, it ain't good. It's not a good time. <laughs> Dear Christ, let there be a save point. Please? Ugh. This place is a nightmare. But it's gonna run again. Just keep running. Don't stop moving. Man, that's trippy. Arise, myself and my shadow. I'm scared, man. Anything, anything could kill me. Anything. Those are all ingredients, but not things I can just eat outright. There's another boss door. That's two now. The ritual is tomorrow. But we have a problem. One of the children we selected, Miriam, has fallen into a deep slumber. And her crystal, which accounts for half the catalysts we intend to use, has lost its power. I suspect, my friend, but it matters not. The ritual ch chances of success have waned, but we must find a way. Whilst Bail did not come, the summoning was a triumphant success. Demons are flooded into our world, proving the validity of the guild's beliefs and the necessity of our presence. However, I never imagined it would lead to such a catastrophe. Was I foolish to heed my superior so blindly? But what is done is done. Good point. Thank Christ, a save point. Alright, we got a boss. <sighs> Alright. We got two boss stores so far, but um, there's no save point near the other one that I could see. Let's just do it. <laughs> Let's do it. You ready? Oh god. I've been waiting for you, Mary. Not you again! The Shardbinders should be struck from existence. Is that it? Correct. But I am here to test you. Not end you. I have no quarrel with you, Zangetsu. Perhaps not. But Carnage is the language I speak. If we are to come to an understanding, this is how we do it. Now, fight as if your life depended on it. It does, doesn't it? You're gonna kill me. Okay, at least I remember fighting you. Whoa, whoa, that's new. Man, I really wish I had healing items. Ow. I am not going to survive this at this rate. I was going to say, he seems pretty confused at the moment. Alright, here we go. He's doing the fire thing. Ow. With no health items, I got no way to survive that. on me after all all right all right attempt number i don't know like probably like 15 or something but this is the first time i've got health potions i actually have health potions this time i thought that was something that was probably worth doing so we got health potions we get him so close we've been getting him so close i feel like shit health potions are all we were missing to be able to beat him Not a good start, though, to be fair, if that's uh, our strategy. Damn it! Ow! Jeez, I never get hit with that. Oh my god. So I come with potions and now I can't fight for shit. Might as well just let him kill me. Usually he's down to, um, 
Usually he's at least at lightning sword by the time he's hitting me that much. Should I just let him kill me or... I mean I guess I should make every attempt count, especially since I'm like counting my attempts so I know how shit I am at this. Damn it, come on. Clipping me with that, that's bullshit. Alright, Ice Sword. This is the one that always causes problems for me. Because of the way it travels across the ground, it's really powerful. Although, having said that, this time, for some reason, even the Fire Sword I couldn't beat. Because I'm being a loser. Probably because I came in with health potions. God damn. I'll just take a shit ton of potions. We'll do this the least clean, most inefficient way possible. I'm scared of the travel on that attack, man. Come on, do it. There you go. That was really, really unclean. Turns out how easy it is when you got a health potion. If my life depends on it when you are clearly not. <laughs> you could tell. Shut up. <laughs> With your skill, you could have destroyed me in a heartbeat. I have a gift for you. It's my penis. That's <laughs> a sword. What are you doing? My sword. The Zangetsuto. I came to England in pursuit of a demon named Gremory. Only by that blade may she be cut down. Gremory? That's the demon that attends Jeeple. But why give the sword to me? I've tried making contact with Gremory. But I have yet to cross paths with her even once. You think she's avoiding you? She must be. And surely you have noticed, that man you're after, Jeebel. Gremory is controlling him. <sighs> but, her hold on him is not absolute. Perhaps you have seen signs. A moment of weakness. A diminishing of his resolve. Yes, when I faced him on the galleon. Good. That means your ties to Jeebel are still stronger than Gremory's, and she knows it. Which means she will not allow Jeebel to be alone with you. When she appears, use that blade. So when we fought him and Cut her down. beat him and lost the game, that was because I should have defeated her, but I didn't have the sword to do it. Wait. Why not so I can do the boss fight now. Do it yourself. Because if she fears me more than she fears relinquishing Jeebel, then we risk losing her. I will have my vengeance on her, even if it means parting with the sword. And there is something else I need to clear up while you deal with Gremory. All right. I will finish what you started. What I started? <laughs> I am certain you will. All right. Nothing over here? So that sword is what allows us to actually do the boss fight with Jeebel. Bless you. Because when we go in to fight him, Grimory will make an appearance and we can mess her up. And then boom. Win a winner chicken dinner. We got a lot more to explore and there's still a boss door over there that we haven't done yet. But we'll save that to the next episode because that took like straight up like 15 attempts. I'll actually count it. But like most of them were done without health potions. Obviously. As soon as, as, soon as I had health potions I could do it in the most like uncoordinated way possible and still win. Which is cool. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for getting out there and I'll see you in the next one.